And so what if our mind, our brain, isn't the only place to start the transformational process? Let me break it down. Most of the therapy we think of works top down. It starts with our thinking brain, you know, logic, stories, analysis. And the hope is that if we change our thoughts, our feelings will follow. But there's this whole other way of looking at it, a bottom up approach. This one starts with the body, with the raw sensations, the gut feelings, the instincts, the bodily feelings, you know, like heaviness on the chest, sweaty palms and not in your stomach. It's based on a totally different idea that our deepest struggles aren't actually stored in our logical mind, but in the non-verbal language of our nervous system. And that gets right to the heart of the problem. A problem, the research I've done, really focuses on. And if you've ever been in therapy, you know this feeling. It is so hard to truly feel something deeply and at the exact same time try to describe it perfectly to someone else. The words just don't seem to fit. So in my PhD thesis, I took this problem head on and proposed a new practical and evidence-based model to bridge that exact gap between the talking mind and the feeling body. And the way this model gets past the limits of language is with a tool that is so surprisingly simple, but it turns out to be incredibly profound. As I've already mentioned it, it's called multi-level neuroprocessing, or MLMP for short. 